Yes, the hands-on video of Pixel 7 Pro is out and we even get the benchmarks of the Pixel 7 which might shock you since the numbers are not that great. A weeks earlier we get the unboxing video from this Bangladesh retailer and now it's time for hands-on benchmark test where the scores are quite alarming. He ran a couple of tests including the Geek Match and Entudu and the results are quite surprising. 1054 for single core score and 3138 for multi-core score. An incremental update over the last year Pixel 6 Pro and if we take a look at the Entudu benchmarks, the phone only hit 800k score falling behind the competitors. The scores on Tensor Gen 2 chipset are matching the Snapdragon 888 or 888 Plus score. But let me get things clear, raw performance is not everything in a phone. Instead, the optimization, battery life will make a big impact on the user experience. Although Tensor Gen 2 chipset is falling behind in benchmarks, but it has a major improvement over image processing and performance of the machine learning and AI abilities. But with these numbers, Google is going to achieve some of the big numbers in the battery life on the Pixel 7 and Pixel 7 Pro. There's a mode called Extreme Power Saving Mode, which you can enable to get at least 72 hours of battery life on the Pixel 7 and 7 Pro. And if you turn it off, on the Pixel 7, you guys will get 31 hours of battery backup, and on the Pixel 7 Pro, you guys will get 27 hours of battery life. Pixel 7 comes with a smaller battery, 4,355 million power compared to the last generation, 4,614. But Pixel 7 Pro comes with the same 5,000 mAh battery. The pricing of the Pixel 7 and 7 Pro is already out and where we will see the Pixel 7 for $599 and $899 for the Pixel 7 Pro. But the pre-orders are unbelievable, where in some countries, you guys might get a Pixel Watch if you pre-order the Pixel 7 Pro and Pixel Buds Pro if you pre-order the Pixel 7. The camera updates are real on the Pixel 7 Pro, with the two big updates we are getting in the telephoto lens and the selfie shooter, 11 megapixel selfie shooter on both Pixel 7 and 7 Pro and 48 megapixel telephoto shooter on the Pixel 7 Pro, but this year telephoto lens will bring OIS, optical image stabilization and can give 5x optical zoom and 30x digital zoom. And with this lens, Google will give you an option for a macro shots on the Pixel 7 Pro without a macro lens which is amazing. Pixel 7 and 7 Pro comes with only two storage options, 128GB and 256GB. Pixel 7 comes with 8GB of RAM and the Pixel 7 Pro comes with the 12GB of RAM. The new Tensor Gen 2 chipset is not a powerhouse when it comes to raw performance, but instead, Google is improving the small things to give a better user experience, just like machine learning by 35% and 20% GPU performance. And if you want to look at the unboxing video of the Pixel 7 Pro, then you guys should check this video. I'll see you next time, till then, peace out.